and welcome to another MI How To video. My name is Tom Clark, I am your host, and on today's How To, we have a very cool demo for you. And right now you're wondering, Tom, where's that really cool Motion Industries red shirt that you normally wear? Well, it's underneath. Uh, I'm covered up with the 3M very cool long sleeve uh, lab coat right here because there's gonna be sparks flying everywhere and the guy who's gonna tell you all about it is Mike Eggert, he is from 3M. Mike, come on in, man, how are you? I'm well, Tom, thanks for having me. It, it is great to have you here. Now, I know we're gonna be talking today about Cubitron 2 abrasive. So what, what is the first disc that we're gonna be working with? This is a Cubitron 2 fiber disc 982C. Fiber discs are great for all of our customers involved in metal fabrication. Often they have to bevel prior to welding, mm -hmm. and then after welding, they'll have to take a weld down and smooth it out to cover it with paint and leave no trace of a weld ever having been there, so you have a nice cosmetic look. The weld is there, but you can't see it. What makes the disc great is 3M's proprietary precision-shaped grain. Say that three times real fast. No, <laughs> <laughs> but historically, we made abrasives with crushed, crushed grains, but now we're manufacturing every grain to a specific size and shape. It's a ceramic, okay. but in this case, it's a triangle. Okay. And they're all the same size. They point up and they slice through that metal with okay. less friction. The result is you remove more metal in less time with less heat and less fatigue on the operator. Further, if you're a welder, but you also have to grind, you want to spend more of your time welding and less of your time grinding so you can be more productive. All right, now before we do that, you're gonna let me grind, right? Yeah. Okay, all right, well, but first before we do that, we have to put on our PPE. Yes, we do. And we have several different types. Normally, we just wear glasses around here for most of our demos, uh, but today we actually have hearing protection and uh, we're putting those in. You wanna make sure that you always wear the proper PPE for whatever the job calls for. I've also got gloves. Now, you're not gonna wear gloves because you're not grinding, correct? Correct. Okay, so um, we had a little lesson beforehand. I'm, I'm gonna. A little bit of an angle, is that about right? A little bit, yeah, just tip it up a little, about seven degrees. Why don't you go get some coffee? I'll be a while. <laughs> nice work. Wow, that, that was good. That, that really works good. So you remove a lot of metal very quickly with these, uh -huh. as you can see it. Oh wow, there's metal all over the place, isn't there? <laughs> now, okay. fiber discs are great. They're the fastest method. Right. But flap discs are great. Sometimes you're doing more than just grinding a weld. You might be doing some finishing or some blending or a little cleaning. That's where flap discs come in. Right. This is Cubitron 2 Flap Disc 969F. All right. If you look at this, it's actually made with multiple oh, let's abrasive show that flaps. To the camera. Let's show that to the camera right there. Okay. And the outer part of the flap will gradually erode away and expose fresh mineral underneath so you get more life out of a flap disc and they're just very user friendly. Now you mentioned about making the uh, the grains for that. Do you do the same thing with the flap disc? Absolutely. And that's nice because flap discs traditionally are slower than fiber discs. Okay. But we've narrowed the gap quite a bit by putting precision shaped grain in the Cubitron 2 flap disc 969F. This is gonna be a little easier, you said. It then. should be. So you can maybe even tip it up just a little bit higher. Okay. It'll have a little more cushion, but it's gonna leave a finer finish also than the than the okay, fiber so, disc. As well. I, okay, here we go. Very nice. You're a natural. That looks a little shinier. Interesting. So if you had follow-up work to do, you'd have a little less work to do getting that scratch to a paintable finish or getting to, to a place where you can set the grain and put a decorative stainless finish. You guys always come up with cool products. Thank you. That's awesome. Mike, thank you so Thanks much. Thanks for having me, Tom. Thank you. Mike Eggert, he is with 3M. And if you enjoyed this video and this demo, then you're going to find a whole bunch more at mihowto.com. My name is Tom Clark. I'm your host. Thanks so much for watching today. That was actually a lot of fun.